any any ways uh, stroke treatment is evolving in neuroscience that you have aware of in the western countries in the western countries they really follow the time to brain very uh, strictly the ambulances they are equipped with a mini ct scanner they take the scan in the in the ambulance itself and they can know whether it is a bleed or whether it is a clot they can even give the blood busting medicines in the ambulance itself after wow. doing simple tests and there's a quick communication to the hospital it's also. a quick communication unlike uh, our indian roads uh, they have a, a very robust Uh, ambulance system the ambulance system uh, in the us has to reach within 7 minutes of uh, calling they have uh, special pathways for these ambulances to go to the hospital they're not stuck on the roads another barrier that they don't have is um, a lot of them have insurance the decision financial decision to take the treatment is not there unlike in india patients have to if they have to pay out of pocket suddenly coming up with uh, uh, or making arrangements or partly paying that amount of money a lot of time is wasted uh, is spent mm. i'm not saying wasted it's spent taking that decision and that would have a bearing on the outcome mm. there are devices which are coming out which will probably come to the indian market which are more safer which can go more distally mm. more distally meaning more more inside more inside to mm-hmm. get the clot out to the capillary level maybe not to the capillary level but to the smaller major vessels like uh, the distal part of the middle cerebral artery distal part of the anterior cerebral artery which we could not have gone till now the other thing which is happening is remote stroke treatment there is a stroke interventionist he is in a big hospital in a big city but a stroke has happened in a smaller town and you can't ask that person to take a car and travel 2 hours to do the stroke so what they have done is they have used uh, ai and robotics to wow to go into the blood vessel one uh, simple uh, person who can get access through the groin from the local hospital local hospital mm-hmm. getting access into the blood vessel anybody can do but mm-hmm. beyond that using the help of uh, robotics controllers from, con- from somewhere, somewhere else 1000 miles away anywhere get the clot out they have done that there wow so we so. can outsource if we have stroke here we can call people from our nearest uh, hospital and then get it treated by us doctors you need to have uh, connectivity you need to have the robotic infrastructure and you need to have uh, a person who would do the basic accesses it's like any desk for uh, <laughs> doctors <laughs> <laughs> okay.